Hey now. Yeah, yeah I've never welcome. tried pot. I don't have a deep desire to, but I've had a few people suggest it to me because... Anxiety? Yeah. Right. And I'm curious. I'm really curious. I'm so afraid it would swing me the other way. Because we've been around people that get really paranoid while they're on it. Yeah. Like and that, I'm afraid that, that I would go that way instead of... Yeah, it's weird because everyone's like, oh no, it'll mail you out. You're like, whatever. And it but might, then, though. But then, okay, it might. But also I've heard so much that's like... You get really paranoid and real weird. You freak out. It's like that doesn't seem calming or relaxing at all. Yeah, what are you talking about? It feels like my about? every day, and now you're just making it worse. Yeah, it's like the whole paranoia thing. Like that doesn't sound like relaxation in any means. Right. I don't know. And not promoting drug use, but I—I I mean, I'd still like to try it just to see, like once, like just once. Right. Like I have no desire to become a pothead, but. <laughs> right. But just. Well, I mean, just out of curiosity, yeah. and I have nothing against people that do stuff as long as they're responsible. I don't think like children should do it because like it actually has a substantial effect on brain development. Right. But like anyone over the age of twenty-five, when your brain is pretty much set in its development, you want to do recreational whatever. Like you're not gonna do permanent harm to yourself. Whatever. You know what I mean? Right. Like yeah, I have nothing against people that smoke it. Just like. I just ask that people I'm with be somewhat respectful to my allergy, you know? Yeah. And, like, if you want to go smoke it, that's fine, just... And it sucks because, like, I do want to be, like, the social component, like, people are like, hey, man, we're gonna go whatever, and, like, it'd be cool to hang out, but, like, I don't want to feel like shit just to hang out. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, that's not worth it. All those Dodongos I just blasted. Dodongos ain't shit no more. Ain't shit. Ain't shit. Bitches ain't shit, but tricks and hoes. <laughs> Is that an actual song? Yeah. <laughs> I want a t-shirt that says that. <laughs> I'm sure there is one. Probably. Yeah, There's so many t-shirts I want that I would be scared to wear in public. Yeah. Like what? I don't know. Like that. <laughs> Just stuff that has... Still those dirty words. Oh, that naughty I wasn't, swearing. I wasn't allowed to say as a kid. Oh, bad words. Oh, you're naughty. <laughs> <laughs> All that she wants is another baby. He's gone tomorrow. All <laughs> that she wants. Oh, this is so gurgly. <laughs> what? <laughs> <Gross>. <laughs> no, I cleared my throat and it was all like yucky. You've been puking up your food lately. My feud? <laughs> your feud. I've been puking up my feud. You've been puking up your feely feud. Yeah, I keep burping and like vomiting in my throat. <laughs> mm. It's tasty. Delicious. Oh no, these little baby jealous. I don't know if it's all the, the alcohol I've been drinking, if that's why. Because <laughs> you're such a fucking drunk. Uh-huh. Oh, that shit wants. You're a little baby. I got drunk with some of my family members a few months ago. They convinced, well, they bribed me to stay and play dominoes via wine. So I was like, we have wine. And I was like, okay, cool. So I got a little a little funny around my aunt who has never seen me that way before. Your aunt? <laughs> my apricot. <laughs> Apricot, yeah. No, it's apricot. That's apricot. <clears throat> I don't say aunt. I can't say aunt. It's, aunt. it's not natural. I didn't grow up saying it that way though, so it just feels weird to me. I feel like I'm being pretentious. Not that people that like legitimately say it that way are pretentious, mm -hmm. but I feel like I'm being because I didn't grow up saying it that way. You know what I mean? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like I'm, I'm, I'm like tomfoolery. Like I'm, I'm not being my authentic self. I'm fooling you <laughs> with my pronunciation of a word that I've never pronounced that way. Oh, you thought I had class? Twas just a jest. Yeah, exactly. I don't I, think it's ever a wrong time to learn how to say something correctly. Eh, no, oh, it's nope. It's past. <laughs> yes. So I may have told my aunt that you hate. Family gatherings. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what, dude? <laughs> she thought that was hilarious. Wh which aunt did you tell that to? <laughs> Rhonda. Why did she think that was hilarious? Because she's like, well, now the truth comes out. 
Oh my god, why did you do that? You are an asshole. Because we were like laughing really loud, like our stupid family cackle that we do. Yeah. And I said, well, this is why Alex hates us. And then, oh my god, dude. And then she thought that was. She you are such funny. a shithead. <laughs> what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Nobody was offended. It was good times. <laughs> is it? Is it not true? I don't hate any of them, and I don't like. It's not because you have a dumb cackle. <laughs> yes, you guys get loud. It's just like I'm not like families weird me out because I don't really have one. You know, right. like mine's all fractured. And... I know it was partly in jest. Ooh, they're going to give me a free big shield. They understood. I tried... Look at this. I was sitting here going like this. <laughs> good, good. That's going to make good audio. <laughs> I was trying to... <laughs> screw the cap off the wine bottle, but there was no cap on it, so I'm just drinking my hand. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Drinking too much. Oh, look at this boy again. You're the one who encouraged it. Should I give him a whistle? Hey, buddy. Listen to this. It's what does it, whistling do? It turns him into a small boy. Did we talk about whistling on here? See, I forget what we talk about in our daily life versus what we've talked about on here. We did, but... Okay. Whatever. Mm. You want to talk about whistling? No, that's fine. I can see now, like, like people that do, um... Um... <laughs> I'm drawing a blank on people that do YouTube videos and let's plays. On the people, you mean the people you watch? Yeah, I, I, all I was trying to say is I can see why people that do this regularly, like, forget things they've talked about or repeat stuff. Right. Like, they'll go, like, a long time without doing it. And I'm like, we just did this two weeks ago and I've already forgotten. Right, yeah, we don't record very often yeah. and you've already forgotten everything. Mm -hmm. Look at that pretty gray. Ooh, because I'm in the middle of being damaged. Like, sometimes even in, um, everyday life, when you tell multiple people one story and you forget who you've told what to. Right. That's why they say it's easy to remember one truth. Uh, it's easier to remember one truth than many lies. So, like, telling the truth is better, because your story is consistent all the time. Yeah, it makes sense. What if you just tell one really good lie to one person? Well, I mean, the reason that you'd lie, right, is because you'd want to deceive somebody, right? Yeah. And maybe deceive them differently than other people, maybe? Maybe, maybe not. Schwoops. Schweppies. I gotta sneeze. Do it. Do it up, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> good God. <laughs> oh, it's ugly. It's ugly place. <laughs> <laughs> Has anybody else ever called you out on your achuga? No. Because <laughs> nobody else is rude. Nobody's a rude Bonty boy like you. I just want to know, when you started doing it, like, did you come out the womb, like, sneezing achuga? <laughs> you're not going to explain to anybody what you're talking about. So when Alex sneezes, he says achuga. <laughs> Every single time. <laughs> Uh, there's probably evidence that I don't every time, but... No, 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 no. <laughs> Unless you do it when I'm not home. But since I've known you, which has been since 2002. So, f going on 15 years, motherfucker. <laughs> you, have been, you have been sneezing a chuga since that time. And I want to know if, like, baby Alex... Like, I, I want to know when it started. And you have no answers for me. I'm sure that there are sneezes where I don't. I think it's just the big ones, but you say every one and I don't believe you. Every single time. I'm gonna listen back to all the episodes and if I ever sneeze once, then it's not an issue. <laughs> every single time, you're just so used to doing it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just like a reflex for you. Why are there so many spitters? I don't usually point, I don't point it out every time you sneeze because it's just what you do. Because then the times I do point it out, you're like, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> you know anybody with annoying sneezes? I... Uh, not anyone I could name offhand, but I really... Like, it bugs me when, like, people have super dainty sneezes. <gasps> yeah. The... Like, uh -huh. that kind of shit. I'm like, oh, come on. Yeah. I had a friend like that in high school. Who, kid you not, she just went... Achoo! 
Achoo! Like every time, and it's like, that's not, you're not even sneezing. You're just making a stupid noise. You're making a mouse noise. <laughs> um, yeah, that's not a real sneeze. <laughs> so if you do that. Fuck you. <laughs> you I guess. Stop bullshitting me.